You too. Get yourself out of sight. One lonely man is a lot less intimidating than three nasty-looking degenerates. Arthur, in that cattle shed on the left. Micah, get down behind that wagon in front. Sorry to disturb you. Uh, my friends and I, well, we got into some trouble up the way, lost in the storm. Ah, uh, gentlemen. We can't help you, mister. I got folks Arthur. dying on the trail. Arthur, we got a problem. <laughs> folks. There's a corpse right here. No, I, I just Arthur, need some there's a body of food in the wagon. I hear you just... Search the cabin. Smells like a party in here. Turn the place upside down. Grab as many supplies as you can. We need the essentials. Food, medicine, whiskey. up here too there's a big price on colm o'driscoll's head nearly as big as the one on yours wanting colm dead is about the only thing me and uncle sam agree on uh, i'm starving well, you should eat something now get your strength up for the ride back Move the women and Jack down here. Maybe. We'll see how they are when we get back. I don't really want us to split up. I'm 
going to start packing the horses. You keep looking. Grab anything you think we can use, then meet me out here. Still looking, Dutch. Just give me a minute. Micah, Arthur, keep looking for stuff. Arthur, go see if there's anything in that barn. Micah, you search the cabin, see what we missed. Sure. Break your neck! <laughs> 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 
blast him. Should I kill him? No. Not yet. Find out what they're doing here, and where Colm is. Oh, this son of a bitch will talk. Huh. Where's Colm O'Driscoll? Uh, with the others. At an old mining camp southwest of here. Near the lake. What are you bastards doing? Why are you up here? Uh, we're fixing to rob some train. Gonna blow the tracks. I don't know more than that, I swear. <laughs> well, I would say it looks like you have this, Arthur. Do what you want with him. I don't care. But bring that horse when you're done. Oh. I don't know anything else. <laughs> Don't want him bolting. Get away from me! Micah, ah! what the hell do you think you're doing? Ah! Hold still, damn it! <laughs> oh, look what I found in the cellar! Wild thing ain't ya! Leave her alone! I wasn't doing yeah. nothing. She's one of them O'Driscolls. No, she ain't, Michael. Look at her. Miss, miss. Yes. Are you... Oh, you fool. Michael. Miss, now, it is going to be okay. We mean you no harm. Miss, miss. Come on. It'll be okay. We need to get out of here and quick. Come on, now. Oh. Are you okay, miss? They came three days ago. And my husband, they... Okay. Miss, you are safe now. And you can't stay here. You come with us. Of course. Miss, it's okay. We're bad men. We ain't them. It's okay. Get on. We'll keep you safe until you figure out what you want to do. What's your name, miss? Miss. Adler. Adler. Sadie Adler. Mrs. I... He... He was my husband.
Might have found a homestead, but he weren't the first. Combe O'Driscoll and his scum, they beat us to it. Uh, we found some of them there, but there is more about, apparently. Scouting the train. Thank you. That's the last thing we need right now, Dutch. Well, it is what it is. But we found some supplies, some blankets, a little bit of food, and this poor soul, Mrs. Adler. Miss Tilly, Miss Karen, would you warm her up? Give her a drink or something. And Mrs. Adler, it's gonna be okay. You're safe now. They turned her into a widow. Animals. I need some rest. I haven't slept in three days. You're over here. Miss O'Shea will show you the way. Mr. Morgan, we put you in a room over here. Thank you, Miss Grimshaw. Mr. Bell, you're with the fellas over there. What? Well, how come Arthur gets a room and I get a bunk bed next to Bill Williamson and a bunch of darkies? Get yourself to bed. Ain't been seen in days. Weather ain't let up. He's strong. And he's smart. Strong, at least. <gasps> Hello, Arthur. Abigail. Arthur, how you doing? Just fine, Abigail. And you? I need you to... I I'm sorry. I'm sorry to ask, but... It's little John. He's got himself caught into a scrape again. He ain't been seen in two... Two days. Your John will be fine. I mean, he may be as dumb as rocks and as dull as rusted iron, but that ain't changing because he got caught in some snowstorm. Please go take a look. Javier? Yes. Javier, will you ride out with Arthur <clears throat> to take a look for John? <clears throat> You're the two best fit men we've got. Now? She's... We're all... Yeah, we're pretty worried about him. I know the situation were reversed and he looked for me thank you this way last I know John was headed up the river for all we know he kept riding north and never looked back he wouldn't leave not like that uh, wouldn't be the first time Smoke. Come on, let's take a look. Let's hope it ain't more of O'Driscoll's boys. Well, it seems somebody left recently. And that way. Sure, well, come on then. There's some tracks leading to the river. Here, Arthur. 
this, John? You tell me. These are horse tracks for sure, but it could be anyone. Let's just see where they lead. So, you were there, Javier. What really happened on that boat? We had the money, it seemed fine. And suddenly they were everywhere. Bounty hunters? No, Pinkerton. It was crazy. Raining bullets. Take it slow. Big ravine here. Dutch killed a girl in a bad way. But it was a bad situation. That ain't like him, though. We continue along the cliff wall here. Davy got shot. Mac and John, both shot too. Sean, we don't even know. I'm surprised we escaped at all. By the time you boys showed up from the other side of town, we were only just holding on. Bad business, all right. And snow's coming in hot again. We'll lose these tracks if we don't move fast. Watch yourself. It's not very wide here. snow here. Uh, I don't know about this, Javier. We, we can't follow nothing. Uh, let's push on a little bit. Maybe we'll pick up the trail again. from here. I'd grab that shotgun from your horse. Who knows what's up ahead? You getting that gun then?
Come on. You sure about this? It's coming from this way. Okay. It's slippery. Be careful. Mierda, that we're high up here. You're telling me. Careful. There's a drop here. Careful here. Stay low under here. Okay from here. Watch your step. Real slippery. Stay close to the wall. Up this way. Sounds closer now. Come on. We're coming, John. How you doing? I'm miserable. <laughs> Been a tough few days. I know. Here, take a drink of this. Thanks. I'm not designed for this snow. Let's keep moving then. Come on. John, can you hear me? Most! John! John, you there? Over here! Down on the ledge! That's John! We're coming! Down here! Down here! That's quite a scratch you got there. Never thought I'd say this, but good to see you, Arthur Morgan. You don't look so good. I don't feel too good, neither. I'm freezing. Don't die just yet, cowboy. Come on, compadre. Well, we can't go back the way we came. Let's try this way. Ain't you a sorry sight? Can't argue with you there. See, I told Dutch you weren't the right man for this. I'm sure you did. You all right? I don't think so. Come on. Hopefully this will lead us out. Look up there. Perfect. You head for the horses. I'll keep John's friends off until you're clear. Okay, here we go, John. 
We'll leave them to Arthur. Blackwater, now this. You had a hell of a time. And Arthur always says, I'm lucky. You should ride in the water for a bit. Try to lose a scent. Don't want to leave a trail right back to camp. You know, we're gonna need to come up with a better story for that scar. So, Carl. freezing, bleeding, starving, damn near getting eaten to death ain't good enough for you. Yeah. Come on. Let's push hard and get back. See those buildings up ahead, John? That's where we camped. Nearly there. Come on! Someone help John down off this horse. Can we get some help here? We need some help. We need some help here. Come on, help him down. You're alive. You're alive. Oh, here we go. There we go. Oh. Ay, oh. careful, idiotas. It's his leg. Oh, come on, let's get you warm. Thank you. Thank you both. This is a new low, even by your standards. <laughs> Thank you, Arthur. Thank you. You got any other lost maidens need saving? <laughs> Not today. Have you and Dutch talked about how we're going to get out of this? I was just discussing with Herr Strauss when the weather breaks. I suppose we'll have to keep heading east. East? Into all that... that civilization? I know. The west is where our problems are worse. Come on, Herr Strauss. Let's get warm. Thank you, Mr. Morgan. <laughs> We have been wrong. 